Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome to my part six, uh, episode six of my first time playthrough of Alan Wake. Um, if I'm not mistaken, uh, this should be the last chapter. So, without further ado, let's just dive right in and finish this game up. I wrote a horror story that has come true. Thomas Zane did the same in the 70s. You will go no further. If I continue like the Dark Presence wants me to, the story I'm writing won't save Alice. It's a horror story. No one will survive. You knew Zane, Thomas Zane. You're the Lady of the Light in the song. He left something behind to help me, the clicker. Alan thought of this as he stood on the rim of Cauldron Lake, the clicker in his hand. He took a deep breath and jumped. I can get to her now. I can finish this. Three years ago. Oh, we're gonna have a prequel, uh, a flashback before we start, huh? I had a hangover. My head was about to explode and the light hurt my eyes. I needed my sunglasses and painkillers to dull the pain. In one of my finer moments of self-deception, I swore to quit drinking. <clears throat> Bruh, if you need sunglasses after a night of... A night out, you know, of drinking. Like, my gosh, dude, you... Well, first of all, I don't think you're drinking. It's more like <laughs> fucking ecstasy. The world looked bearable. Now I could keep my eyes open without feeling like a vampire in the sun. Yeah, like yeah dude like that is fucking oh by the way the wake you look slick with a sunglasses boy all right well, first of all if you if your eyes are hurting from a hangover it's not fucking alcohol and it's, it's like fucking ecstasy dude and if that's not the case then I, you really should have get that check dude i wasn't sure i'd make it out there without some painkillers Wait, so where are we going? Like, why do we just wake up hungover, need glasses and painkillers? Like, and then we immediately need to do something? The pills worked fast. The prospect of being awake started to seem bearable again. All right, that's absolute bullshit, Wake. You know, medicine takes, on average, 15 to 30 minutes to kick in. You cannot just, like, fucking pop the pill and it immediately feel better dude and if that's the case it's a placebo effect that means you weren't hurting that badly to begin with anyways so can we get a message oh. waiting for me on the machine all right before we get out i just want to like fucking look around here wait so you live in new york and you decide to get like a triple panel of like the new york city i suppose I think that's New York City, right? Rather odd. I would, you know, for an artist or writer, I would assume he would pick something more, uh, you know, a bit more matching. Like, well, well, you already got a fucking city view right outside. Why do you still need, like, pictures of it? Anyway, let's listen to the message. Oh, is that why why we have a hungover? We were on like quote unquote business meetings. <clears throat> well, that would absolutely make sense if they're on the oh. talk show the previous night, talking about my latest book. The show was supposed to be waiting for me on our TiVo. Well, that would absolutely make sense. Why uh, we pop some uh, MDNA? Because um, fuck like. I mean, isn't that what artists likes to take? Or like, you know, they, they wouldn't be drinking alcohol. That's like pleb shit. Right? If you, if you party of artists, you, you, you get the good stuff, man. Anyways, let's go watch some TV. And then we'll see. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the 
Can I focus on? Thank you. Thank you, everybody. We have a great show tonight. Oh, I'm just going to walk up to it. Best selling author Alan Wake about his new book, The Sudden Stop. Yeah, good read. Go buy it. No, no, it is a good read. Look, uh, I'm going to be honest here. Is that wise? No, but I'm going to do it anyway. I got people who give me the lowdown on books. I'm a busy guy. But this one, I actually read from cover to cover. I mean, I'm, I'm a big fan. Wow, thanks. Now, this might be a spoiler for those who haven't read the book yet. Based on the sales figures, the two people out there who haven't read the book yet. <laughs> but this last book is all about the death of the main character, the hard-boiled New York detective, Alex Casey. Now, there's been a lot of outrage about it. Is Cal Alex Casey a character in this? Casey. What the hell were you thinking, man? Good riddance. <laughs> no, seriously, though. Seven years and six books is a long time. He was a gloomy guy to spend all your working hours with, and it was a good run. But it's time to explore new things. My next book will be a departure from the old for me. You selfish bastard. Always thinking of yourself. Well, you've certainly given us a lot of entertainment over the years. And now that you mention it, Casey was a gloomy guy. Never had much luck with his love life with the ladies. Was that autobiographical in any way? Yeah, no kidding. Casey's lady friends tended to die on him. With Casey, it was all about his pain. No, nothing autobiographical about that. I'm a happily married man. My wife is my muse. <laughs> well, congratulations. That's great to hear. So, how's the publicity tour been treating you? Good, great. But I gotta say, I'm glad to be back home in New York. Well, you've certainly been on the news a lot lately. Lots of parties and, um... You got into a fight with some paparazzi. Oh, man. Well, that guy was really in my face. I lost my temper. I know that wasn't cool. Uh, you are famous for that temper. <laughs> well, I did also write several books. <laughs> Well, your latest novel is called The Sudden Stop, and it's in bookstores now. Go get it. That means the two of you out there who haven't bought it yet. Ladies and gentlemen, that's all we have for you tonight. I want to thank all our guests for the evening. Alan Wake, Sam Lake. What's more, do the face for his Sam. <laughs> and our musical guests, Poets of the Fall. Thank you. And At least I've been funny. I told myself I could live with that. I didn't say anything stupid if that's what you want to know. Are you going to start with me about drinking now? You know what? Go back to sleep, Alan. Why is Alan in such a bad mood? Oh, check what? the ass out. Dang. Well, this morning I was angry because you said you'd be home at midnight and you showed up at 7 a.m. and passed out in mid-sentence. Now I'm over it. Are you angry? This goddamn tour. It's gotten out of hand. Oh, honey, it's almost over, right? We can get back to normal, and you can start writing again. I'm sorry, honey. Alan, you're not thinking straight. Just take a shower and go back to bed, huh? Yeah, you're right, honey. I'm sorry. Once this is over, let's go away together. A vacation, just you and me. Some peace and quiet. Oh, that's rather sweet. I, I that was not what I expected. <laughs> Somehow, the clicker was the key to the cabin. I had to return to Cauldron Lake to save Alice. I'm going back to the lake to finish this. I'm going to write an ending to the story in the manuscript on my own terms to make it all right. Why can't you just write it here? The last page is still in the typewriter. I need to read it first. Everything needs to be just right. Zane tried to cut some corners, and it didn't end well. Okay, ready when you are. I'm sorry, Sarah, but I need to do this alone. Barry, take her gun. Miss Weaver, close the door when I leave. Wait, why, why, does we, why do we need to take the gun from the, from the sheriff? Good luck, Al. See you later. When I got out, it was warm. 
storm is sunny. I'd flick the switch of the clicker. Had it done this? I didn't stop to question it. I had to take advantage of the sunlight to get to the lake. On Zane's page, I'd stood on the rim of Cauldron Lake, about to use the clicker. That's where I was headed. All right, um... Let's get Hello. to it. Oh, wow. In okay. Daylight, surrounded by the beauty of the Pacific Northwest landscape, it was hard not to let doubt creep in one last time. I could still chalk everything up to a dream, a delusion. I had enough imagination to make up something like this, having been in the cabin all this time, trapped in a story inside my head, gone mad from grief over Alice's death like Hartman had claimed. There would be no way of knowing. I told myself it didn't really matter. My course was set. You know, I would be very, very disappointed if this game pulled a quick one on me now. You know, like, like I had a little bit of a doubt at the beginning that this was all an illusion. But then now that we have a lot of these characters bringing into the story and now it does seem like it's a lot of like supernatural shit. And it's like, if they suddenly pull a quick one and be like, aha, it is all in your imagination. I would be so fucking disappointed. I remember I made this rant a couple of parts ago, but like games and movies that does that that like pulls a quick one on you and like you know basically say whatever happened didn't really happen is all an illusion i fucking hate it and i think like no i i remember there's a theory behind it too like someone like i think okay i think don't call me on this because i'm not an artist or anything but there was um there's a theory behind it and it's called something and like basically whatever the viewer sees in the game or in the movie they trust you to not lie to them. But at the end, if you pull a quick one like them, like that, then it's like the trust is lost. And it's like, you know, suddenly the, the viewer or the player just wouldn't like it. Anyhow, so we are. Wow. Yo, this is so sensitive. What's going on? Well, Verizon, yo, how much money do you think Verizon had to pay to get their billboard on here? And it's like now it's like immoralizing this game. You know, you know what? There's something cool about Alan Wake. Like the whole t the use of the TV, the use of billboards like that. It made the world seem a lot more realistic. And I kind of wish they did more of that. But I think like it might have been too costly. Right? Like because you're making a lot of resources that like, you know. Perhaps it could have been delivered easier, like the story and everything, the lore. Now, nowadays, all you fucking get is like, dude, I should really, oh, I should stop using my right stick for this. Nowadays, it's all about like, you know, fucking audio logs, right? It's like, oh, you fight a bunch of monsters and then like, you know, oh, you pick up some dead guy's audio log. And it's like, um, you know, and then and, and, and it's all audio, right? Like, there's no visual effects or anything like that. Ooh, someone left a six-pack here. What? What a waste. Although, I have to say, like, I mean... It's kind of warm by now, I'd assume. Let's go check out this trailer. Knock, knock. Anyone home? Okay, I can't even get in. Okay, I, I guess I was expecting a little too much from this game then. Alright, um, let's drive. The Majestic Motel. Comfortable beds, clean room, wireless internet, laundry facilities, cable TV, and kitchenette in every room. Ninety-seven point six KB FFM. Is there any items there? It's kind of rather annoying. Um, well, I guess it's good because it builds the world to make it feel more real. How you have like the, all these like things you can walk around to explore. But it really bugs the hell of me. I like, you know, to get off my. Oh, there you go. Rifle. Yeah, see, if I didn't come down, 
I would have missed this rifle. Then I would have been uberly fucked. You know what's funny? I think these are all the pathway that we have, um... Maybe have explored in the prior... Episodes? Or chapters, whatever you call it. Oh. Oh, nice. Okay. Can I continue exploring? Oh, I think it's done. I love how this is like the only way the game makes you like explore their maps. <laughs> at, at, at least they reward you for it, I suppose. I feel like if this game is made like nowadays, like if it's going to be like Uncharted, for example, they're just going to give you like these collectible medallions or coins or whatever, right? Which I guess it isn't so bad. You know what, now on second thought, I think I would rather be be like Uncharted. Where it's like they just give you a collectible and be like, Hey, thanks for like checking out the resources that we made. You didn't have to come here, but you did. Thanks. I'd rather they do that than to actually like, you know, put a rifle there. So then later I figured I was like, Yo, what the fuck? I missed the gun or miss bullets. And now I'm out of bullets. What the fuck do I do, you know? Oh, look at that. Hold on, hold on, hold on, guys. I want to check out this... this scene. Oh my gosh. Is it just me? I'm just like, this game's beautiful. I'm gonna take a screenshot of this. Okay, should we go in, go check out that... Uh, let's go check out this, uh, barn, I guess? Can we open it? It looks... like... it's... oh, okay. Coffee. There's a collectible. Um... It does not look like I can get inside this barn. So in that case, I would continue then. Nope. Can't get in. All right. You know what I realized? Like when I'm like walking around this open world, there's one game that I, it's also everyone says that's a masterpiece, but I've yet to. Sorry, I'm just like, do I get off my car here? Is like, is this the end of the road for this car? I guess so, right? Okay, let's get off this card then, I guess. Uh, another masterpiece that I have not yet played. Oh shit. The darkness had touched me. There was a link between us. Always would be. I could feel its presence again, getting closer. Okay, there's nothing in the van. I get inside these cars? Oh, I guess I have to just walk, I guess. Oh! I will kill your wife. All right, all right. I think we're good. Okay, I, I don't think there's anything behind us. Yeah, I think we're good. Oh, suddenly it turns dark. Nice. So... <laughs> well then, so much for broad daylight. I was gonna say like, oh, that's very nice of them for like the last chapter giving us this much sunlight. Manual script, nice. Sorry, to just finish up my thoughts. So, um, one masterpiece game that I have not played yet was like, um, fuck, what's that detective game? I've just lost my chain of thoughts. It's, um, 
Ah, what was that game called? Hold on, give me one second, guys. I'm just gonna Google it up right now. Um, L.A. Noir. Yes, that's what it is. That's another game that I think people say is a masterpiece. Um, they spent a lot of money on getting like facial capturing, so much that it basically bankrupt the studio. Right. Um, but that's a story for another time. Let's focus on this playing this game right now. But that's one game I would like to play in the future as well. Oh, motherfucker! Okay. Well, I just run those motherfuckers over. Did I kill that motherfucker? Okay, there we go. I can't reverse? The fuck is this stupid car? Like, when I pressed left? Yeah, I couldn't reverse earlier, but now I can. I don't know why. Anyhow, which way do I go? Oh, well, I can't go that way, so I guess that, that answers that question. Okay, so what do I do here? Do I go inside? Well, there's aspect, there's definitely resources inside, so let's go inside and take a look. Alright, so. Um, okay, we are looking at a rather empty space. Open. Uh, can I turn off the flashlight? So fucking bright. Oh, okay, let's read. The Majestic Hotel. General information. Refundable $100 security deposit is required on all reservations. No personal checks accepted. We take all major credit cards and bank cards. Checkout time is 10 a.m. No loud music. No pets. Uh, one vehicle per unit. Facilities are registered guests only. No visitors are allowed on the premise after 9 p.m. No exceptions. We hope you enjoy your stay at the Majestics. If you're a senior or a vet, ask about our discounts. Cool. Uh, coffee? Oh. Why is there fucking coffee in the washroom? It's like, washroom makes you, uh, like, coffee makes you want to shit, and then now it's like, you're Based just drinking. The in the motel oh, hold on. Agent Nightingale had stayed here, in room number two. Oh, room number two. Is that where we're supposed to go? Okay. Yeah, it's like you're drink. it's like you're shitting, and then you want to drink things that, like, you know, makes you shit even more. It gave me a shotgun here, so, so I think I'm going to switch. Even though I do like the hunting rifle more, but I'm going to... I don't know, I'm going to trust what the game is going to throw at me. Uh, they might throw me like a cluster of enemies, so that's why they gave me a shotgun. Anyhow, room number... I have got fucking know what this room number is. Oh shit. The fuck is that sound? Is this Oh, okay, it is his room. This what the fuck? Obviously been the room where Agent Nightingale had stayed when he hadn't been busy harassing me. Is that like Did that fucking thing just fell from the fucking roof? It does a can that just fell. Is this all pictures of like our what Alice? Like our wife? Okay, we got some flashbang. That's good. Washroom. Can't go in. Creator's Dilemma. Oh. Hey, is he making, like, big shrimp? I, I can't see what that package of snacks he's eating. Big... Truffler? Uh, I, I don't know. Oh, shit. Okay. Okay. Should I explore the other rooms? Are they even open? Okay, they're not even open. 
I'll give it a shot anyway. Why not? Okay. They're not even open. And behind the back? Doesn't seem like there's anything behind the back either, so... Alright, so I guess we will proceed. I am rather confused what this detour is about. So, like, what? Like, just... Show that Agent Nightgale has been... Oh my gosh, this car doesn't look very good. Let's go... Get another car. This car looks rather... Alright, looks like it's broken. Okay, let's go find another car. I'm guessing what it shows us there is that like, hey, you know, Agent Nightgale has been spying on your wife. Or some shit like that. Oh my gosh, like this, can we turn off the light? In okay, yeah, we did turn off the lights inside. Okay, I gotta stop using the right stick when I drive. I'm so, I'm so used to other games where it's like they allow you to like scout around with the with the right stick. I guess that's like a, a feature that was implemented afterwards. So I know this is a dead end, but I just wanted to check to see if like there's any like uh, whatchamacallit. Uh, either resources or uh, or manual scripts, but it seems like they have neither. All right, so let's get out of here then I guess. Anything here in the middle? Nope. Ah! Huh. Ow! Holy shit, motherfucker! Oh my god! Oh my god, this is... Okay, I gotta like, confront these guys, huh? Alright, these guys would be rather simple if I just like... Okay, there you go. Like that? Is that it? Oh, there's more. Alright, I'm just gonna run these fuckers over. There you go. Done. Easy peasy. Can I drive on this? Wait, really? Is it collision blocked? No, you fucking ki Oh, I, I guess it doesn't matter because... Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit! Hey, he dragged me out of the car! This is GTA! Alright, so, you know what? Fuck it. Let's just make it over the bridge. Uh, did I fuck up? Can I go? Oh, I absolutely fucked up, guys. You know, I feel like Alan could have, like, make it through these... The, the, like, this, um... Like, like, through these bars. Right? Like, he's not that fat. I'm sure you can squeeze through. Anyhow, I bet you there's gonna be tons of shit coming up alive anyway, so... Let's keep our battery open. Oh wait, hey, we still got the big boy, eh? We still got like the big boy battery. Alright, so we gotta get our flares ready. Oh shit! Okay. Anything else? What the hell is that horn thing there? Ow. What the hell? Yeah, what the hell is right? What's going on? Alright, anything that he's coming out? Oh. Oh, I, I 
I ran out of battery on that one. Shit. Whoop. Bye bye. Uh, I guess I will walk this way then, huh? Alright. Okay. Nice. Anything else? Is that alive? I think so, but I think... Oh, okay, yeah, I can still get him. I think he's... Okay, I think he's gone, dude. Um... Just flared him up. Whatever. There we go. This one? Or is it this one? See, I knew it was one of those green barrels. Fuck. Alright, there we go. Got both of them out. Uh, is that thing alive? Oh shit, that thing is alive. Ow. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, so what should I do about that? Like, flashbang it? Do I have to go- Oh my god, you fucking kidding me, right? That is a save point? Oh my lanta. Alright. <laughs> I'll have to say this though. The save point in this game is sometimes a little brutal. But, um... Ah, well, what can I do about it, right? Ow. And I think one thing that really bothers me about this game is, like, whenever there's these, like, possessed Edom sessions, it's not very exciting. Right? And it definitely isn't exciting when... You know, it's pre it's pre rearranged, right? Like you know what's coming out alive. And generally speaking, these little ones are not gonna kill you. Famous last words, so watch me like one of these refrigerators kill me. Oh, that's it, yep. See and the and the car dropped exactly that way too. Is that gone? I think it's gone, dude. Oh, shit! I ran out of battery at the last second! Is there anything? I don't see anything. This one doesn't come alive, it's the one at the back. This one, I think? Oh no, they draw one down for me, I think. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, they draw one down for me. Ow! Motherfucker. Alright, so, this time, we're gonna be ready for this. Yep. <laughs> I'm glad you can find this humorous, Alan. I'm glad you can. So I toss like two flash and one um, fucking flare on him. That's not too bad. I'm guessing that's what the flares and flashbangs are for anyways. I don't think there's any going to be much challenge here. 
Ah, uh, more shadow guys in the front. Oh my god. It's a fucking monster truck. Possessed monster truck, baby. He's stuck! I win! The winner's me! Get fucked! Uh, which way do I go? I reach a checkpoint. I don't know if it is so I'm supposed to go though. I just saw the light and I'm like, okay, let's head in this way. I don't know if this is the right path. I got me a flare. But I got a feeling this is not the right path, boys. I just, 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 just like something tells me this. Well, I might as well get a new fresh car, right? I might as well. All right, let's hail this way. Oh, let's get that coffee, boys. You know I'm a coffee addict. All right, so what do we do now? Back on the road? Alright, let's head back onto the road. Shit, I hate my bad habit of like swapping cameras with my left. Ah, shit, I'm stuck right now. Oh, okay. Good, I'm not stuck. But which way am I supposed to go? I'm so fucking lost. Alright, I'm just gonna follow whatever the fuck the compass tells me. Alright, this way then. I love how at this point in the game, I'm just like mo driving through and mowing them down. Okay, I, I'm guessing it's things are falling. Oh my god! Oh my god! Ow! What's going on here? Is this a checkpoint? I think there's a checkpoint, dude. Yup, okay. Checkpoint with a bunch of supplies. Uh, pump action shotgun. Is that better? I have no idea if it is better, but hey, you know what? Whatever, we'll take it. Okay, we got a bunch of goos on the floor. We'll clear those out. Why not? Pick up the garbage. More flares? Yes, flares. Alright, don't worry, we got some time. We'll kill these things, no problem. I do think these goo transforms into humans. Or like, you know, whatever, the shadow monsters, if you don't get rid of them. Dude, that's like a fuck ton of them, man. What the hell? Like, who took a giant ass dump around here? Okay. Oh shit! Oh shit! Okay, okay, let's try to line him up. Okay, 
Never mind about lining them up. Never mind about lining them up. Oh shit! Ow, motherfucker! There we go. I think I got them lined up. Yeah, yeah, I think I did. Because normally that guy would have taken like two hits to kill. Oh my god, are you fucking kidding me? That's a lot. Oh shit. Oh shit. Flare, flare, flare. There we go. Oh shit, 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 shit. Oh my gosh. I didn't realize my revolver wasn't loaded. Oh my gosh, you're kidding me, right? Oh, these checkpoints are kind of brutal. Okay, I guess they're not too, too bad. Right? If you compare to, like, you know, like, old school games, this, this isn't too, too bad. And by old school, I mean, like, I don't know, like, Mega Man or something. I guess the modern day games have spoiled me. I, I was, okay. If this was, like, a game that was made, like, in the past couple of years, you know, like... I think they would put drop me right in the spawn before all the uh, action starts, and not force me to go through this uh, cleanup effort again. All right, but this time I'm not gonna be so cheap on the uh, flashbangs. I, if I see a bunch of them, I'm just gonna chuck them out. All right, so we got two. Okay, yep. Oh shit! Where is the other one? Okay, I'm gonna use a shotgun on this side. Okay, yep. Okay, we got those two guys out. Reload. This time I'll make damn sure I remember to reload. Because I think that's what got me last time. A shotgun. I'm going to reload the shotgun too before the next engagement. Alright. We ready to rock. Let's go. There's a canister here. Where is it? Where did it come from? Okay, there we go. Okay, okay, okay. Oh shit! Oh my god, I was trying to maximize the fucking canister. I'm such an idiot. Okay, you know what? That was a new mistake. Okay, let's 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 um let's not do that again. Let's not do that again. And I shouldn't be trapped inside that like semi tight spot anyway. That was a bad play on my uh, on my part. Bad tactical error there. We're good. Oh, we got one more. Oh. All right, so we're gonna have two. Yep, we're gonna have two here. We're gonna stand behind this one here.
Oh shit, I'm using my shotgun. Fuck, no wonder they're dying so quickly. Alright, but I do have a lot of shotgun ammo here, so I'm gonna try pulling one here. Alright, here we go. Alright. Okay, yep. Yeah. Okay, okay. Oh shit. Oh shit, dude. Nice, I got free on that one, I think. Oh shit! Alright, alright. Oh shit! Oh shit! No! Why did what why was there one behind me? Alright guys, I gotta stop being a noob. I gotta stop being a noob. Fuck. Oh wow, this is a nice angle for all three. Here we go! Let's do this again. Hey, Elven Ring has given me a lot of practice. Alright. Yup, reload weapon. Oh shit, wrong button. Okay, so we got plenty of that, plenty of that. Let's reload this boy. Okay, there you go. Fuck, motherfucker, are you someone shooting me? Okay, yup. Alright, now we're gonna bring out the big boys, alright? Oh, bring out the big boys. Alright, we're gonna bring out the big boys. Oh my god, I will pull- oh my gosh. Oh, okay, that one sucked. That one sucked. I don't know how they got there. Oh my gosh. I absolutely got ganked there. I feel like this chapter was supposed to be like, I don't know, an hour and a half, and I, I swear that I'm already like <laughs> extending it to like a two hour mark. <laughs> Oh well, it is what it is. It is what it is, man. Shit. Alright, alright. Uh, round two? Around, uh, no, not round two. Like round four or five or something about now, alright, boys? Shit. Oh, shit.
Okay. Okay. Then there's two more that's coming up on us, yep. Okay, there should be one more. Unless the game pitied me and it's like, didn't spawn me one more. Okay, well, it might have been from that, so... Alright, flashbang. Not gonna cheap out on this time. That's what I said last time too, but didn't work out. I gotta make sure I check like all 360 on my uh... Okay, yup. There we go, all four, nice. Pick up, pick up, oh. Oh shit, motherfucker. There we go. Okay, okay. We spent like three flashbangs there. Not great, but I do think they're efficient, okay. I think we're good. I think we're good. Best run so far. After like three tries. Okay, okay. We're good. We're on checkpoint. Okay. Yep. You know, for a second there, I thought I, I was, I was wondering if I'm gonna run out of battery because I think at one point I was like at down to like seven batteries, and I was like, shit. If I don't have my flashlight, that would suck. Horizon, by the way. Check out the new Black Friday deals. Uh, up the road? Yeah, I guess so. Okay, so we, okay, yeah, nice. Okay, we got the... Sale! 50% off! Hell yeah! You know I like a good deal. But I think we're gonna go for this ammo cache. Hopefully give us a bit more shotgun bullet. Uh. Ow, motherfucker! Oh, where? Oh, there you go. I think that's it. Yep. Okay, well, oh, that's definitely worth it. Like, I had to spend, like, what, six bullets back there? To get two flashbangs and two uh, flares? I think that's totally worth. Anyhow, but, um... Oh, shit! I was going to scratch my ear, but my headphone fell. Let's check inside and see. Oh, read. Uh, all visitors must see the yard manager. You must sign a liability waiver before entering the yard. If you're looking for a specific part, ask for it first. For you pull it, you must bring your own tools. Wear protective clothing. Warning, junk piles may shift. Hazardous area. Okay. Is there... Fuck. Hunting rifle? Okay. Oh shit! Alright, so... Uh, I- okay, coffee. I'm hoping to get more- okay, battery's good. I'm hoping to get more rifle bullets. How many do I- we have? 11? It's not a lot. 
Oh, okay. Give me one sec, guys. Yeah, I don't know why my ear is getting really itchy, and every time like I try to scratch it, my fucking headphones just falls off. All right, we got. Okay, I think that's the button that we used to get an old flare gun. Yes, probably one of my uh, favorite weapons. Anything here? I think that's it. Hey, wait to look at that. Oh shit! No, I wasted a round bullet. I wanted to shoot this with this, and I can't even shoot it anyway. Fuck. Oh well. Ah well, boys. Don't worry, guys. We're, we're in hard mode, all right? That, that's the reason why I did it. If I have too many resources, then it's like... It's gonna be not... Too easy. Can I go out now? Okay, yep. Yeah. I pressed the button, right? Huh? So did I press the button? Huh? Oh shit! Yo, there's a lot of them spawning on me! Oh, there's a lot of them coming, actually. Alright, you know what? I should probably get a car. Let's get inside our car. Let's head out. Let's head out! Off, off we go. Ooh, there's bonfire up there. And there's like a fucking swinging car. What? Uh. Okay, let's drive the car down. Why not? Okay. Is this gonna come alive? I feel like this is gonna come alive. You know what? I feel like these monsters are gonna come alive from this side. So I'm gonna like reverse park this and have the light shine on them. Yeah, there you go. I think this is good. Oh, no, I can't, because... Once I take... That's bullshit, man. I should just, like, be able to turn on the headlights. Okay, we got a manual strip. Sure. You know what? This map is by far one of the larger ones. It's like there's so many different paths you can go. I'm not surprised if I miss a lot of manual scripts. Okay, we got one flare. Before we Okay, yep. Reload all my bullets, yep. Ah oh, fuck. Oh my god. I'm oh my god, I'm fucking this up. Okay, that works, okay. Oh hey, my save point died on me. How oh, nice. Well, junkyard. They didn't warn you the junkyard is gonna be dangerous. Okay, we got this. We got this. We got this. I knew that it was gonna happen.
What did I tell you guys, man? What did I fucking tell you guys? That thing's gonna come alive. And we're gonna be prepared for it. <laughs> I saw what does it do? Okay, it's lifting it up. I'm guessing I'm supposed to go through under it. Uh, well, we're gonna grab a car, even though this car is absolutely fucking trash by now. Oh, I can't! The car's dead. Well, so much for that. Well, there's a checkpoint here, that's good. And there's another car, that's also good. Uh, anything down here I can pick up? Does not look like it. Uh, any manuscripts hidden around here? Uh, does not look like it. Okay, sure. You know, I don't recall the last time I've ever seen, like, a car being crushed into cubes like that. Like, in real life, I mean. Actually, come to think of it, have I ever seen one in real life, or have I just all been seeing videos? Ah, well. Wonders of life. We will never know. Alright, so... How much further do I have to go to this cauldron lake? I feel like I'm rather... You know, it, it, I feel like I'm lost. I don't recognize any of these roads at all. And I, I get, I'm hoping, praying to fucking God that Alan knows where the hell he's going. Okay, so we got another checkpoint. That was... Okay, that was such an odd checkpoint. It's like, you have a checkpoint down there. Like, right before... Right after the, you know, bulldozer boss. When and I told it, Barry oh. my plan back in the well-lit room... I'd acted as if I knew what I was doing. I didn't. I was operating on the shifting logic of a dream. I had to fight my way to the lake through the horrors of the night. I had to flick an old battered light switch imbued with childhood magic. I had to write a happy ending to a horror story. I had to save my wife from the dark prison she was being held in. Okay, we got a lot of flare gun ammo, which is great. We're gonna, like, kaboom the next fucking mob that comes at us. But yeah, I, that was rather odd, right? That the checkpoint is, like, you have a checkpoint, like, down the hill. Okay, you drive, like, for one minute. Oh, look, there's another checkpoint, like, literally, like, right when you get to this, you know, the upper part of the hill. See, when they, like, well, I don't know. I guess what I'm trying to say is, like, why would they design a checkpoint like that uh, when there's no immediate danger? Uh, the oppositely, they forced you to, uh, you know, restart your checkpoint right at the beginning of, uh, you know, when you're cleaning up the uh, fucking goose on the floor. Follow. Oh, I'm having a lot of faith on these little yellow signs that fucking the lantern lady left for us. Um, why am I holding flare gun? I should be holding. Yeah. So, am I stuck? Oh, push. Dude, you're gonna kill Alan, man. We already established he's not fit for anything. Actually, you never know. Maybe he's super strong. But he just have absolutely no cardio because this motherfucker doesn't jog a single day of his life. You know what this reminds me of this commercial like there was this uh, I remember uh, seeing this commercial that was like it was like this um Well, let's say a heavy set kid and he was like opening up like this package of like uh, Pokemon cards and then the wind blows off of it like, I mean, he was admiring the Pokemon cards right one by one and then a wind a strong wind came by and blew one of them like like down the streets and then the uh, more heavy set kid was trying to chase after the cards but he couldn't because he ran out of uh, breath after a while and then the commercial was like you know you never know you'll need it you know um keep yourself healthy basically i think that's what he was trying to say motherfucker are you giving me a shotgun 
Do I want a shotgun? I guess so. I do have more bullets on a shotgun, so maybe. Alright, so, uh, just gonna do a quick check to see if there's any manual scripts. Doesn't look like it. Okay, we're gonna... There's two giant lights here. I'm gonna assume that we didn't get ambushed here. Like, that's my only assumption, that why they would give me, like, two... I will never give her to you. Okay. Holy shit, bro! Okay. I'm confuzzled. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, I thought like all those fucking things was gonna come at me. But I don't see anything else. I do see items in here though, so I'm gonna go in and pick it up. Well, I'm like loaded up on resources right now though, so... Alright, what's next? Hollow and Co. I see a copy. Tell this. Oh, I don't want the other shotgun though. Hunting rifle. Nah, fuck it. I only have like 11 shots on that thing anyway. Alright, so. Are we confronting the big bad monster now? I don't understand. I'm kind of slightly confused to be honest with you. Okay. Oh, okay. Well, that's fucked. Okay, okay. Oh, shit! Oh, this one's rather weak. I can't turn that way! Alright, fine. Okay, there you go. I want to flashbang him? Yeah. There you go. Alright. Have I? How many more shots do I got on this? Yeah, okay. I only use like one, I think. I use a lot of flashbangs though. But I guess it doesn't matter. I, well, I mean, I guess flare is more valuable. At least for me right now. Uh, manual script? Yep. There's a manual script. Or in like some sort of forge or something. Oh. Was that it? Oh. I guess that was just to get a manual script, huh? Wait, so where am I supposed to go now? Do I go back into the house? I... Let me go backtrack and go back in. 
I got a feeling should be here. Oh, okay, there we go. Bye bye. Okay, now what? Okay, checkpoint. Wait, why am I wasting thing on this? I'm just checkpointing this. And it disappeared, yeah. Why am I wasting resources on this guy? <laughs> I could see Mirror Peak in the distance. We do? That's where Cauldron Lake was. Oh, okay. Wait, so that way? Okay, we're, so we're almost there. Kinda. Uh, I do see an uh, emergency box up there, so I'm gonna go up there. I think that's flare ammo. Oh, it is flare ammo. Fuck, we're loaded, boys. Okay. Reload all my guns. Oh, reload the fucking shotty, bro. Reload? Yep, oh, wait, there we go. I don't know why sometimes, like, I reload. I click, like, like I hit reload, but it doesn't reload fully. Oh, anyhow, I actually have to go down there. Okay. Actually, this is where I need to go. Wait, do I need to get on? What? Oh, okay, there we go. Release break. We We are... Indiana Jones! Yo, those birds, those fucking crows do not look friendly. Yeah, I'm just gonna blast the shit out of them. Not gonna bother with, um... Fending them off. Oh, shit. Bye-byes. Oh, hey, climb. I almost missed this ladder. You know, there's one thing cool about... I think I like this game. Um... Wait, actually, should I, should I even climb? There's a... Wait, hold on. Before I climb, I gotta go to the checkpoint. I don't want to do that scene again. Um, one thing interesting about, like, this game is, like... They... They kept, like, the environment the same shade as, um... You know, like, like the... The, 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 the non-interactable environment. So it's, like... Some of these ladders is, like, unless, like... She really notice it... You can actually miss it. And I think in modern day games, it's like, they kind of just highlight it for you, right? Like, they would purposely make... What's going on? Oh, fuck. Like, in modern day games, they would purposely, like, make the ladder or anything interactable, like, a little bit more shiny for you. But a little bit of myself also feel like, it's kind of cool that they do that, right? That they kind of hide it inside the environment. I think the the only other game that I think does that is like Left 4 Dead, I think. Or, or is it no no, I think it's Back 4 Blood. I think like um I think you have an option to like make ladders like not very um visible or something in that game. Like there's a setting for that. Motherfucker. These fucking birds. I'm like slowly killing them off. I don't know what to do about it. Oh yeah, I think I, f I, I, I told him to f off. What's going on? I hear something. I don't see anything though. Is it the birds? All right, you know what? Fuck it. Let's just run. Ah, fuck the birds! No. Okay, okay, good, good, good. Birds are the worst type of enemy, man. I love- oh, I got an achievement for that. If it flies, it burns. Nice. <laughs> you know what? I- I- you know what? I, um... 
I wonder if there's still people that do like achievement hunting in like nowadays. Like is this still big of a big community? I remember like I think, okay, like I think it was Xbox that first came out with the whole achievement thing and I think like that this whole leaderboard thing is like, oh who can unlock the most achievement or some shit like that. And I remember reading this story about this one guy. He's like been like number one on achievement, like for a long period of time. And in this one time, where this one guy got uh, overthrown for first place, was because that guy actually was getting married. And so he was like, you know, going on his wedding, and so he didn't have time to like, you know, uh, tr uh, achievement hunt, and that was the only reason why he got dethroned as being the first. And I thought that story was fucking hilarious. Oh, there's a lot of fucking goo on the floor. Thank god I didn't confront the monster like in the middle of the field. I'll be like stepping into a landmine. Oh, you know, I think I remember now. Like, I think they hurt you. Like, I don't think they transform into monsters. But they hurt you, um, if you step on them. I remember I... I remember one of these, uh, one part... ...of the game, I accidentally step on them and it hurt. But yeah, I wonder if there's still people who do, like, achievement hunting. Like, I mean, because achievements are no longer, like, an Xbox thing now, right? Like, you know, there's... There's Steam achievements, I suppose, right? There's PlayStation achievements, right? But I actually don't know if there's leaderboards on those. Uh, so I don't think there's anything. So we're gonna proceed. Oh, emergency box. I think we're still very good with resources. Yeah, like six flare shots, 23 pump action shoddy. I guess the difference between... I, okay, I... I what I noticed, at least, is that the pump action shoddy has more shots. Um, but I presume it's also like... Sorry, I'm just trying to backtrack a little to see if I miss anything. Yeah, okay. Um, yeah, I think the pump action shoddy actually has more shots. Uh, before I have to reload. But I... Presumably, the, the cooldown on it, having to pump it, is like a little bit more... Slower. Alright, so, uh, okay, walking down this creepy forest. Oh, motherfucker. Okay. Oh, shit. That was not what I was intended to do. Fast boy, huh? Can I run around him? Or do I have to confront him? Oh, there we go. Fast boy. There we go. Got him. The fuck? There we go. Yo, that fast boy took a lot of shots. I swear it must have been like four shots unless I missed like... You know, his like... You know, weak points. The fuck is this? Bring a bitch! Yeah, the shotgun, the damage, I still don't, I, I honestly don't like the damage on shotgun, because it's almost the same damage. Actually, I think it's double the damage of, like, um, the fucking, um, pistol. But the rifle, it's like, from my understanding, it's like double of the shotgun. 
That's how I understand it. It's so much better if you can just like use a hunting rifle and just like kick off one of the big guys. Oh my gosh, I don't know why this music is actually kind of good. Oh my god, what the hell is this? Creative flare, I don't know if that's the right play, but Fast Boy, eh? What where? I hear a stomp. Oh, okay, okay, let's get rid of this fast boy first, man. All right, now. All right. All right, I got three on me. There we go. Nice. Now that's a good value on the shot. There we go. But but scenes like that, I I feel like it only happened like two or three times in my life in this game. Like that is such a rare occurrence. Oh shit, there's like coffee in there. Okay, okay. Oh shit! Okay, flare. Preemptive flare. I was worried I was gonna die. But uh, where are the monsters? Oh, there we go. Oh, it's a fast boy, no wonder. Oh my god, one of them shanked me. And one of them is a fast boy too, shit. Oh my god, I- Oh my gosh. The checkpoint's down here? You gotta be kidding me. Alright, I guess I have to fuck around less. the fast boy. All right, it's fast boy. Come on. Yeah, I'm, I'm not fucking around with this fast boy anymore, man. Like, those fast boys are actually really tough. There we go. Right, let's do some reloading here. Reload break, reload break. Did I get the coffee? I did not get the coffee. Alright, I'm not gonna rush the coffee. Fuck it. Right, maybe on second thought, I'm gonna get it. Got the flashbang. You know, I could just toss a flashbang at the fast boy. Oh, there's two of them.
Alright, what? Alright, I got like, I got a canister here. I actually got two canisters around me here. So I might want to like, crowd around there. There we go, I got one. Oh shit! Alright, we'll crowd around the second one and we'll blow, the, blow this motherfucker up here. Are you coming? There we go. I wasted a lot of shot because it's spreading my shots, but... Whatever. Uh, this boat just came out of fucking nowhere, so I'm gonna see if, um... There's anything around it. Doesn't look like it. Shotgun ammo is low, so that's gonna be a problem. Oh shit! Motherfucker, get fucked! I just dropped the fucking, uh... Flashbang on them. Oh, I have to, like, earn my fucking checkpoint now? What? Okay. Resources, sure. Okay, now what? Do I... Which way do I head out? This way? Oh, okay, okay, this way. Okay, I'm blind. Uh, is all my bullets ready? Yep, all my bullets are all loaded up. You know what's one thing I don't like about the icons? Is like, why is my flashbang so, so alike to my flare? here oh I thought I was gonna like roll down the hill and and like you know stampede over me but huh I'm so confused what's happening right now like oh okay things are falling down from the sky Okay, okay. Now, now I know it's, it's like, there's like these giant ass, oh, what the fuck? It's like these loud ass stomping noise, but I don't, what the fuck's hurting me? Okay, whatever it is, let's get the checkpoint. I, I don't want to fuck around, don't want to fuck around and find out. All right. Uh, the darkness were... The I can't see shit because this thing is so bright. Or, well, where's her face? Okay, cool. Okay, free flares. That's not bad. I think like uh the flare gun. I think I gotta put put into good use soon. Oh, hey, look, we're at the one and one hour and one and a half hour mark. You know, I was going to assume. Wait, pick up pump action shotgun. Is that? Oh, OK, just gives me more bullet. I already have a pump action sh shotgun. You know, from historical trend, each episode is supposed to be like one and a half hour. So I'm guessing like this. I'm running over time because, um, well, I mean, I fucked up that one sequence there at the bridge multiple times. Uh, Do I just head down? Guess so, huh? Okay, so I- oh, okay. So I came in here, I went upstairs, and I got a bunch of resources, and I think I can leave this place somewhere? Is there a way for me to get out of this house? Cause because, I, you know, for God fucking knows why, Alan cannot just crawl through these, you know, broken doorways. 
for God knows what reason. Do I go here? Okay, I think I go here. Wait, I can't even- What? Alan! Al Al Alan! Please! Please! Stop being a pussy! You you're fighting shadow monsters and you're scared of falling down like a two fucking- Sorry, like, why can you jump out that one and not the other one? I don't get it. I don't get your logic, Alan. What? Okay, anyhow. What the fuck am I supposed to do now? So I go back upstairs? And fall at a different angle? Here? Oh, I guess I'm supposed to fall here, not, you know, the other place. God forbid, no. Alright, so I got emergency cash here. I hear some noise. I see resources and power generators, so... That's a lot of flares I'm carrying right now. Alright, I hear chainsaw, which means I'm getting my fucking... Preemptive strike? Fuck. That didn't work as well as I thought it would. Did I get him? Yep. Oh, he still got a fast boy on me, though. Alright, there we go. There we go. I think I cleared all? I can't fucking tell. Oh, motherfucker! Oh, motherfucker! Oh, motherfucker! Oh, motherfucker! Fast boys? Nope, the normal boys. Okay, yup. Cool, cool, cool! I think we're good. Uh, the revolver ammo? Yup, nice. Uh, I'm just gonna make a round. Here? Nope. Ah, uh, fuck. Where's he come? Oh, okay. I think that's a normal boy? Yep, normal boy. Actually, he's a wee- Oh, shit! He's a weak normal boy. Shoot pistol shots? Come on. Alright, so now what? Oh. It's a fucking slow-ass moving elevator thing. Makeshift elevator. Come on, boy. I don't got all day. Alright. Well, at least you got a checkpoint. You know, I, I for some odd reason, I am extremely, like, focused on, like, where all the checkpoint is after that whole incident. About, like, restarting that same bridge sequence, like, three times or something like that. Alright, so, uh, get the fuck out. Oh shit, no! Motherfucker. Ah, uh, no! Alright. Back up we go. <laughs> Okay, so which way am I supposed to exit? Like, this side? Okay, okay, that makes a lot of sense, huh? You know, it's still 
mind boggles me how well I guess the map layout is designed. Turn back now. Bitch, please! I'm here to whoop your ass. Alright. We'll see who whoops who then. Ow. Alright. Okay, yep. Yeah. Is that it? Oh shit, dude. Nice. Good use of shock and shell there. Alright. I see how this is gonna go. I know how this is gonna go then. Oh, that's- oh, damn. That one's getting good at the pistol. Ow, motherfucker. Alright, oh. Okay, nice. Uh, reload. Do as you're told. Bitch, please! What do I look like? Your dog? Do as I'm told? Please! At least buy me dinner first. And I'll do as I'm told if you buy me dinner. Yes, I am cheap like that. I'm a cheap date. It's never left you. Ooh, you bitch. You fucking bitch. Oh, wow, shit. Oh, my gosh. Okay, okay, calm down there. Oh, my fucking god. What the hell? Right, what's going on? Do I keep going? Yep. Is this a final at the end? Oh my god, this is such a... Oh my gosh. This is fucking crazy. I love it. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, this is kind of like some fucking... Cthulhu, you know, HP Lovecraft shit going on here. You bitch! No! You fucked me like that! No way! Come on! Oh my gosh! <laughs> what? Okay, okay. Okay, wow, this is rather rougher than I thought. I don't know what the fuck is happening. I'll be honest with ya. Okay, so we got a lot of flat flare guns here. Oh, infinite flare guns, so I got it. Okay, we got infinite flare guns here. I'm guessing we gotta use flare gun for something. So is there like a platformer now, suddenly?
Am I? Is it? Is this on my head? Oh, what's going on? What's going on? Oh shit! Fucking birds! Okay. I I I feel like I did it. I feel like I did it. So what's the plan, Alan? Do we use the clicker in the water? Shh, baby. You were having a bad dream. Her it eyes are freaky. Holy shit. No. Everything's fine. You're home. It wasn't a dream. Everything's fine. Turn yeah. Turn the lights on! Shh, baby. The power's out. There's no light. Come back to bed and I'll make you forget all about your fear in the dark. My fear? It's your fear. Why aren't you afraid? You're not Alice. Turn the lights on now. Where's the clicker? What did you do with it? Alan? You're scaring me now. Okay, where's Go the clicker? Where's bed. the clicker? I think we're gonna find the clicker. Oh, where's the clicker? Your manuscript. It's brilliant. Departure is your best work yet. You're a genius. I'm so proud of you. Come back to bed. We'll talk more about it in the morning. Clicker, is that the clicker? That's not the clicker. Fuck. Where's the clicker? Okay, I gotta find the clicker. Where's the clicker? What's going on? Come back to bed, Alan. Come back to bed, Tom. Oh! Ow! Wait, where am I supposed to find a clicker? I see the thing there. There you go. Is that it? You must find your way to the cabin. It stands in your way. It won't let you pass. It has no heart. It's filled with darkness. You must fill its heart with light. Hey, there's another us. Don't mind him. He's Mr. Sh Your friends will meet him when you're gone. Use the clicker. What? What's going on? Telephone pole? Shopping cart, path, barrel, phone, what? Is the game like slowly getting bugged out? Oh my gosh, this is like You know what this reminds me of? Fucking Metal Gear Solid 2 When in the end you found out that the whole thing was like Or majority of um Of your uh of your life as a simulation or some shit like that? I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm guessing I'm supposed to clean these out.
Okay. I'm slowly transforming the world back here? I'm leaving you. What? I'm leaving you, Alan. I met someone. I'm in love with someone else. Alice? No, what do you say? You can't. I don't love you. How could you? You don't even love yourself. All you do is torture yourself with work and you can't do anymore. No, I, I love you more than anything in the world. You're, you're my muse. I know. Who are you? What have you done with my Alice? Alice? What are you doing? Put the light back on. What are you doing, Alan? Stop! Put the light back on! It wasn't true. Nothing like that had ever happened. You're not my Barbara. Tom, let me go. I promise to be good. Please, untie me, you naughty boy. I will help you write your masterpiece. I will love you forever. No, you're not Barbara Jagger. I made a terrible mistake. I should have never written you back. You came back wrong. Your heart is filled with darkness. Put that knife away, Tommy. Get down. My heart is filled with darkness. I'll cut it out. Oh! Oh! Take you back to the depths of paper. Wait, what's going on? Did, did, did Alan get crazy and cut someone off? Okay, so we're slowly coming. Get away from me, you hag! Where am I? Let me go! Alice! Alice! I'm coming! Alright, so we're Your husband refused to do as he was told. All he had to do was write what I wanted. Oh shit, should I have stick around for more conversations? Now you will never get her back. Much older than you. I can see that. Older than your first work of art. I will find a new face to wear. Uh, someone else to dream me free. Huh? Can we stab them with a clicker? What the fuck happened? Did we just stab her with the clicker? close by I understood what I had to do now I knew how to write the ending to departure there's light and there's darkness cause and effect there's guilt and there's atonement but the scales always need to balance everything has a price that's where Zane had gone wrong there's a long journey through the night back into the light Is he reversing time? Like, is that how his writing is... What his writing is doing? I'm guessing she's freed now?
I'll be honest, it's been so long since I've seen Alice. I actually forgot how she looks like. <laughs> I forgot how my wife looks like. God damn it. Wait, so what happened to Alan? Is he trapped in the darkness? No way, come on. to say this parade looks so pathetic it's like one fucking car <laughs> that's not the sheriff oh wait, oh wait, this is back in time that's why yes oh what who's that what Wait, what the fuck? <laughs> I don't and I don't know why my audio is like acting a little weird right now. Okay, oh okay, there we go. The music's coming up. Okay, no, that was pretty good. Uh that was pretty good. Alright. Uh, you know, as usual, following with my uh, you know, I guess my tradition, I'm gonna share a little bit of my thought fit thoughts while we watch these credit roll um you know so far i think the game was pretty well made right i think um you know i might have mentioned this at the beginning of the series but like one of the reasons why i'm finally getting back to this game uh, sorry no i'm not getting back to it this is my first playthrough but one of the reasons why i'm digging this old game back out to play it's because i've heard a lot of great things about this game right i always feel like um every once in a while when it's during the halloween period or something people will always dig this game back out and play so you know and, and there is a lot of good reviews about it so i i wanted to like you know play it right it's a good masterpiece and i have to say it's um it's pretty good it's pretty good i think it's you know okay it's atmospheric right i think the environment was done very very well it did give a lot of um suspense and all that stuff um now i'm not gonna fault this game a little too much but i did feel like maybe near maybe um i don't know like the 75 percent mark of this game have slowly became um a little bit more repetitive right um but i'm not gonna fault this game too much for it i feel like most horror and suspense games do end up being like that Right, like, like you know, all the monsters eventually feels the same. Some are tougher, some are weaker, you know. But um, they, you kind of just, you know, attack them the same way, really, right? In terms of the story, I think the story is a little whack, right? It's a little bit um, I don't know how should I say it. I feel like it's like um, it's um. I feel like if the entire town is being cursed, you would assume there's more people that know about this curse. So the fact that like some people know it, some people don't, um, you know, like um, uh, some people take precautions about it, some people have absolutely just living on their life like normal. I don't know. I don't know if that's like, uh, you know, really believable. And that is why one of my theories at the beginning, it's like, hey, is this all inside Alan's head? Right? In fact, I don't even know. Is this still inside Alan's head? Because 
At, you know the ending when we saw, like he's still typing, right? He's going crazy typing, right? Um. Anyways, but um, overall, I do think it's a pretty good game. You know, the environment's really well made. The uh, combat is not clunky at all. Uh, you know, it does give like sort of like an eerie small town kind of uh, narrative. And all in all, I think I've enjoyed this game. You know, pretty much throughout the way. Right. Again, like I'm even. I'm. Even, I think my only negative thing about it is like at about 75 percent to 80 percent of the game, uh, things got started to get a little repetitive. Right. But you know, hey, it is what it is. And with that, you know what, I'm also gonna say, you know, thank you so much for watching my videos. If you stuck through my entire series, you know, hey, thank you, thank you, thank you. You know, I can't th appreciate more enough. I know, uh, you know, it's a lot of hours that you guys, you know, you guys are watching me. Uh, so, you know, thank you for, you know, you know, share, sharing your time with me, all right, pretty much. And with that, I think uh, I'm done. I'm just gonna let this um, credit roll out. By the way, this is totally gonna like, you know, strike my video, right? Because this is like a DMCA or whatever, like like users' right or whatever, right? Oh, and special mention to the fact that like I'm pleasantly surprised that even for such old game, that you know like they support ultra wide. But I okay, like I mean, ultra wide is only like five percent of the market right now as of I'm recording. At least that's what the stats are telling me. But you know, the fact that this game still supports it, you know, I like greatly appreciate it. And it's like, um, and if they went back and they made an update to support ultra wide, hey, then more to fucking kudos to you, Remedy Video, uh, Remedy Studio, um. I do, I, I do plan on playing uh, their, their, the next game, right? I think uh, the one that they made out uh, subsequently to Alan Wake was like, what, I think it's called Control or something like that. Um, uh, if I recall, I did. I have purchased it. I just, again, never got around the time to play it, right? So maybe one day I'll get around to that. But uh, no. And with that, I think that's all I wanted to say. Um, I'm just going to let these uh, credit roll out. Uh, please do support these guys, right? Like watching these uh, credits if you guys will. If you don't, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys around.